hello guys i'll show you in this video how can we split the back of the cabinet into two parts like this and also we can split the ends of the cabinet into two parts so stay tuned hello guys so i'll show you how can we uh, split the back of cabinet into two parts so for example i have this blank and uh, i'll just drag any cabinet here okay so this is my cabinet you can see it look like something this okay it has a single bag here and suppose i need to split this bag into two parts how can we do that so if i select this product and go in product edit here and if i look for internals so to split the bag you should have a fixed shelf here okay for example see this shelf is adjustable right here you can see this in wire so this one this red one is our adjustable shelf and therefore i'm not getting any uh, adjust button any option to split this see i'm not getting any option here to split this into two so for that i should have a fixed shelf here so i'll delete this one and select this space and i'll just click this grid and divide into two parts by a fixed shelf okay now this is our fixed shelf now i can now if i select this fixed shelf it gives me the option to split back as well as ends so here you can see my back is a single part and my ends are also single parts okay now i will split both so i'll show you first splitting back so for that remember we should have a fixed shelf here in the cabinet and then we can just select that fixed shelf select it and then uh, click this split back now my back is split it see right in the same way if i see here you can see this one it is splitted into two parts i'll just check here by going in the parts and i can check two parts are here the wireframe these two this lower back and this is upper back okay now it is splitted into two same thing if i want to split this uh, these ends into two i'll select again this one this fixed shelf and i can just hit this split ends now see ends are also splitted into two parts right and if we check the parts here i can see the ends this end this lower end this upper end here okay upper lower this lower and this upper okay so both ends are splitted so this sometimes it's uh, we need such things to split the bigger parts and uh, suppose after splitting i don't want this fixed shelf here i can just go here and just uh, hit the delete i I'll, in parts i'll have to select this fixed shelf and just hit delete okay so i have deleted my fixed shelf and though i have uh, splitted my backs and ends into two parts so hope it helps guys so i'll show you another example with a tall cabinet so save it uh, mostly we, this happens with the tall cabinets we need to split the backs and ends so i'll just drag a standard tall cabinet from here okay some gap between them i'll select this uh, this cabinet and hit enter and now if you see it's 3d they are all single parts this uh, uh, back and ends okay so let's split the back and ends into two or just i'll split the back only in this case so see i don't have any option to do that what i want i want to split this back from the middle so i'll select here and hit 
that grid and divide that into a two parts by the fixed shelf okay and uh, i'll select this fixed shelf this fixed shelf and select this and now split the bag now the bag is splitted see and if i check the parts there are two bags so in this case and suppose now i don't want this fixed shelf anymore i can just select this from the part this fixed shelf and hit delete okay so fixed shelf is deleted and still i have my bag divided into two parts so hope this helps guys thanks for watching i'll come with another fantastic video soon If you like this video please subscribe press the bell icon to get the instant notifications of the upload i'll keep uploading trainings tutorials videos for the cad packages so keep watching stay tuned thank you